told you. That's a snake head. Yep, why are you lying in? That's a big one. It's a big one. He's all twisted up. Get the net. Well, welcome to Mental Health Day. If you saw recently, I posted a video of me trying to get my son Seamus to catch his first snakehead. Unfortunately, it didn't happen for him, but I caught a few snakehead that day and some nice bass. Today, I have my daughter Grace out here on the John boat. We're going to see if she can catch her first snakehead. We would be happy with any sort of tight line. It was raining this morning when we woke up and I uh, just saw that it stopped raining and it's an overcast day and we're going to give it a go. It's better than sitting at home twiddling our thumbs. What else to say other than let's go fishing. Yeah. I might have to pop it a little bit to get it out of there. There you go. I'll drop it straight down. Perfect. I just start winding it slow and keep your rod tipped down because if something bites it then you can pull it straight up. Okay. We usually always see a fish right around this, this, this bend over here. Good job. See this little pocket over here? I always try to throw in these little pockets. In the, in the pockets and at the points. Perfect. That was perfect. You're doing good, Grace. We usually always see a fish right in here for some reason. You can kind of cast a little sidearm too, so you don't get it up so high. I've been doing some sidearm. Oh, there we go. That's a huge bass. That's an absolutely huge bass. See how big his face is? You want me to get the thing? Yeah, you can get the net. This thing's a crazy huge bass not, not by the head hold on hold on oh my god head first head first good job hold on you did good grace you did real good holy crap hold on i gotta come down there i gotta come down we can but we try not to holy smokes told you there's always fish right here that's a big one we caught some big bass this year Hold on, I he's gonna. I might have got him stuck a little. No, he's fine. He's fine. I'm just trying not to get my the hook in my my hand. Where did the frog go? It came off. That one was getting old. Now I get him off the hook. See that? It got both hooks in him. He's got him in there good. That's a big bass. <laughs> <laughs> good net job. He's not as huge as some of the bass we've caught this year, but he is a thick, high bass. He is 18 inches. Holy moly. That's a nice one. We've literally just begun and we knocked the skunk off. Not the species we're looking for, but hey, a tight line is always awesome. And that one was acrobatic and gave me a tug fest. What? You keep fishing. You gotta kiss your first bass of the day. Thank you for the fun time. Thought you were a snakehead. Have a good day. That was awesome. Whew. You see how crazy that was? It looked like fun, didn't it? Wait till you get a snakehead to bite that. Now remember, if you feel something Bring bite it. it, you gotta really give it a good yank. Is that, where's Waldo? <laughs> There's a little wind sack says, where's Waldo? All right, that was fun. I gotta get a new frog on. Let's do, this, do some more of that. Cast right there. Right down that shoreline. That'll work there too. I was talking about out here. I was like hang out right by them points. That's a perfect shot. Good shot. Keep that up. You'll, you'll have a fish bite your line. It's a matter of time. The wind's guys going way too fast. Holy crap. See that? That's a big snakehead right there. Friggin' wind's got us whipping down the shoreline. He's not gonna eat, we spooked him. That was a big snakehead though. Dada, what does it feel like when the snake gets it? It's gonna be a real fast, hard pull on your rod. You'll know it, trust me. Sometimes the bass will grab it and swim right at you. 
and you don't even feel them. The snake would usually grab it and turn real quick. It's real sharp. It'll be a boom like that. Oh, there's one right over there, Grace. Can you cast for little splashes? Oh, you gotta, you gotta get it there, Kaboo. I don't want to hit you. Don't worry about me. There's a fish feeding in here. He just came up right in front of the boot. <laughs> Told you. That's a snakehead. Yep, wind your line in. That's a big one. That's a big one. He's all twisted up. Get the net. Get the net. Head first. Hold on. Watch out for the rod. Watch it. Get it off the rod. You're fine. You're fine. Look, he's hooked great. He's not going to get off. Get him in there. Oh, yeah, God. we got one. Thank God, he's heavy. <laughs> he's not even that big. I messed up a little. You did great. Here, give me a high five. Oh, this thing, though, my line just like went a little. That's okay. We'll fix that. We got a snake head. Yummy food. Is it big enough to eat? Yes, it's definitely big enough to eat. Yum, 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 there might be another one in here. Right now, they're they're doubled up. See, we we saw that one feeding over there. There might be another one over there. Okay. Here. I'm gonna deal with this one. Let me know if you get a bite. Hey, hey. Oh he just spit out the frogs right over here. Yep. Yeah. He's got his mouth open right now. Give me that mouth. Look at that hook set. Two double hooks right in the roof of the mouth. This one hasn't spawned yet. This is a little fat female. It felt way bigger than that. We're gonna give her a little measure. I'm gonna guess somewhere around 22, 23 maybe. She's a very bloody one. She's only 22 and a half. But that's big enough to eat, right? Oh, absolutely, that's big enough to eat. Bring that home for dinner, girl. Do we have more snakeheads? Oh wait, no, we cooked all of them. We cooked the ones from when we went out with your brother, but we're gonna have some more to cook. Good net job, Grace. Yeah, I'm the Now we gotta see if we can uh, get you to catch one. I'm gonna process this one, dispatch her. We were over there where the wind was beating us up. We crossed over here where it's nice and calm and we saw this fish feed. And I had her try to cast that as she came up short. And I put it right on the money and got one in the boat. And we can get some more. I'm gonna dispatch her. How do you do that? Like this. Thank you for your sacrifice. Night, night. All right, you're ours now, fishy. Yes, there we go. We just put it in ice, ice. <laughs> Sing a vanilla ice. Yeah. If you saw the episode when I was out here with my son, we forgot the hammer and uh, I bled out a fish and went to throw it in the cooler. And not only did it jump up out of the cooler, knock the lid off the cooler, but it almost made itself out of the boat. That would have sucked all the way, so. Remember the hammer today, if we get Grace on one of these fish, that'd be awesome. All right, we gotta go somewhere better. I'm gonna set it as damn wind. All right, so change of plans. I mean, even though we caught a fish way back there, it's too windy over here. The wind's blowing right up into this cove. So we're gonna cross the river, try to find a spot out of the wind, a shoreline out of the wind. And hopefully we land some more fish. They don't, they're not easy to catch. Even when you see them, a lot of times they don't even eat. Just gotta keep casting. Good cast. Well, we ended up changing spots again. I cannot believe we didn't get a sniff where we just were. That's the shoreline that's been fire all spring. But I haven't fished this shoreline since I was a kid. I've never even tried to target snake it over here. So we're gonna give this a try. Hopefully, last stitch effort. We're out of the wind. That's all we ask for right now. <laughs> It's kind of a pain over there. It's warm. It is warm. At least you were smart enough to bring a jacket. I got them goose pimples. Woo! Oh! Got a fish! Oh, it's, it's rolling like a snakehead. Feels... You got the net? Yep, it's a snakehead. Yeah. Get him in the net. Yeah, got another one. I wish you'd have got him. Here, you put here, put put the net down there. I Just, was eyeing that one. I was eyeing this place. I was like, when we get up there, I'm gonna cast over there. Uh, well, you can still cast over there. 
Like I said, there might be more than one. Heck yeah. I was losing faith, baby girl. Awesome. Got another one. I love netting this. <laughs> you like netting fish? I'd, I'd like netting fish too. You can give me a shout today. I will. Hopefully. 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 Is that a keeper? They're all keepers. It's not a monster, but it's a nice fish. Nothing wrong with that. Probably about the same size as the first one. That might be another female that hasn't hasn't spawned yet. What do you mean spawned? They they have a big belly. Yeah. She has eggs in her belly. Oh. So she'll make more snakeheads someday. Well, she won't because she's gonna make dinner. Uh, we won't have time tonight but soon this fish will make food for our family and we thank you for your sacrifice and then we say night night reunited and it feels good there we go i got two in the box girlfriend give me some bam we haven't been fishing this shoreline very long. Obviously, we're gonna continue doing it. It's a little more windy over here than I'd like it to be, but if there's fish, we're gonna continue. Cast this point over here. Cast like past it, and there's some little grasses. Yeah, I get a little closer. Still might work, but. All right, if you feel something bang on it, you gotta set that hook. Cast the point. Nice, come on fishies. Keep plucking all these little spots along here. This looks good. There should be a fish in here. There you go. Oh. Oh. That was a snakehead, you see it? Yeah. Yep, missed the hooks. That's a good sign. I told you there's probably fish on the shoreline. They're still feeding, that's a great sign. Keep plucking, keep plucking. If you nice shot. If you think something needs it, you really gotta whack it. Set that hook. If not, they're just gonna spit it out. Keep plucking up in here. Get out in front of the boat a little bit. That's, that's nothing wrong with that. That's a good cast. So you can drop it right next to the shore like that. Keep plucking. Up here. Nice cast. That's perfect. Come on, snakehead. Be there. Come on. Eat that frog. You're doing awesome, Grace. The fish just are being buttheads. Oh. Did you get a hit? It just... It looked like you had a hit there. I did, but it was like the shortest thing in the world. Alright. That's probably just a little fish that sucked on one of your tails. You'll, you'll know a big one, it'll thump it. Keep on plucking, it looks like a good spot right over there. Good cast. Come on fish, eat that thing. All right, you go straight up with it. Fast and as hard as you can. Good cast. There's no reason why a fish hasn't yanked on your line yet. There's no reason. Cast way in there, Grace. Way in that pocket. Way in there, come on. That's good, that's good, that's good. Come on, fishy. Cast in a pocket. Perfect. Come on, fish, eat that. Eat that, fish. Come on, fish, eat that. Eat it, fish. You're getting robbed, Grace. You are getting robbed. Put it right where you should. I'm not gonna cast in there. I'm gonna let you cast in there. Okay, I'll cast out here. Nice. Come on, fishy. Nice cast. Come on, fish. Not even a bass in there. Zero bass 30 right now. Sun's setting. Take one whip away in there. Last cast. Come on. You got a perfect spot. Eat Grace's frog. Just suck it. Just put it in your mouth. And eat a frog. What's wrong with these fish? You did awesome she fished the entire time making great casts right at the shore i don't know why these fish did not want to eat her frog and i know a lot of people out there be like well you're in the front of the boat fishing all the good holes i wasn't in the front of the boat but i was skipping a whole bunch of places there's shorelines that i didn't fish at all trying to get her to catch a fish and for whatever reason these fish are buttheads and they're being buttheads today 
But if you we come out, we can come another day. We can come another day. And if you make casts like that, I can guarantee you're going to catch one. Either way, we got two snakehead we're bringing home. I got one that popped off there at the end. Thank you guys for watching. Until next time. You don't know the line? No. God bless. Oh, no.